To play True American, the drinking and obstacle course game from the TV show New Girl, you'll need four or more players, furniture to stand on, a bottle of liquor, and a lot of cans of beer. Start by placing a small stand or table in the center of a wide open room. This will be the castle. Put a bottle of liquor in the center of the castle and arrange four lines containing at least five beers each branching off of the liquor bottle. The bottle is the king of the castle. The beers are the pawns, and the spaces between the lines of pawns are the four zones. Imagine the four zones extend all the way out into the room and fill each zone with five pieces of furniture that players can stand on. If you don't have furniture, you can use pillows, blankets, or even sheets of paper. The important thing is that players have something to stand on since the floor in this game is lava. Arrange the furniture in each zone in a circle and make sure the spaces are close enough for players to jump from one space to the next. Make sure one space is within reaching distance of the castle. If you want to play the game in teams, to make it more competitive, have every player hold up a number between 1 and 5 on their forehead at the same time. Whoever has the same number is on the same team. Keep doing this until the teams are even. To start the game, every player shotguns a beer at the same time. Whoever finishes first goes first. Whoever finishes second goes second, and so on. The first player yells, 1, 2, 3, JFK. Then everyone else yells, FDR. All of the players Grab a pawn from the castle and run to a random space in one of the four zones. Players can move one space on their turn, and they move clockwise around the circle in the zone they're in. Once a player reaches the space closest to the castle, they get another pawn and move on to the next zone to the left. Players must always have at least one pawn in their hand and no more than three pawns. If a player finishes their last pawn, they're out of the game. A player is also out of the game if they accidentally touch the lava. A player can open and finish a non-pawn beer to re-enter the game at any time. On a player's turn, they can give the other players a chance to move in one of three ways. First, they can call out one, two, three, at which point the rest of the players Put a number between 1 and 5 on their forehead. Whoever is holding up a number that no one else has moves forward one space. Second, the player can say a quote and ask the other players to finish it. Whoever finishes the quote first moves forward two spaces. Third, the player can say two people, places, or things and let the other players guess what the two nouns have in common. Whoever guesses first moves forward three spaces. Players continue to take turns until all of the pawns have been removed from the castle. At that point, the first player to finish the pawns in their hands land on a space next to the castle and take a swig from the king wins the game.